Hello YouTube, it's Jordan. Um, so I have like one more shift at work at Radio Shack and then it's like no more, um, no more work. <laughs> and then all my soccer's over and like Saturday, so I definitely plan to be be making more videos more often. Um, that was my fucking <laughs> cat. <laughs> this is my dog. Oh, come on! <laughs> Cleaning himself behind me. Um, but yeah, so I definitely plan to be making more videos. I'm actually really excited right now. I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make a video later today. I have to go read some more and like highlight some things so that it's not like me reading on camera. But um, really exciting stuff as far as um, legislation being written and stuff um, like committees, think tanks going on about transgenders in sports. So I'll have a video where um, I have a packet like this thick that I just got from the director at my community college, who's like really pumped and um, you know trying to get this all figured out and, um, you know, just well-defined and clear so that there's no, like, discrepancy with me playing on the team. Um, but yeah, so that, that should be up, like, tomorrow or today, but that's very cool. Um, basically, yeah, just, God, I'm really excited for the next couple of weeks. Like, I am, uh, going on a rafting trip. I'm actually going to my brother's wedding, which I'm really excited about. There was a big drama, a big fallout with me and his uh, fiance. Um, a whole issue with like, I was gonna be a bridesmaid, which was really cool. But then like a month and a half later, she called me and was like, oh, but you have to wear like a black pantsuit and a black top and a purple scarf. <laughs> And, you know, walk your little sister down the aisle. And I was like, no, fuck that. I'm not... It's a summer wedding. I'm not wearing black pantsuit, for one. And, two, I'm not going to be the only bridesmaid up there in, like, all black in, in a pantsuit. Like, it was just really, like, intolerant of her at the time. And I found out recently it was from a lot of pressure she was getting from some of the groomsmen who didn't want to walk me down. And she's thinking her family's going to be, like kind of appalled that I'm going to be in a dress in the first place and I, I was like well, well their hang ups are not my own and I was like honestly I challenge <laughs> said groomsmen to, to pick me out at the wedding and I got this dress for it oh my god uh, I can't wait um, it's going to be so so fun so um, that's um, in like two weeks I'm really excited for that and then a rafting trip and then I'm going down um Going back down to Beverly Hills to, um, to see Dr. Mary again, he's giving me a, uh, or I'm getting another surgery um, on my face, so he's just going to like fill in my lips a little, my upper lips are really like bird-like, <laughs> little tiny lips. I never wear lipstick, I don't know if you guys noticed that, but I, I like, that's why I paint my eyes up, because like, it's like, look here. <laughs> oh, and that's, that's a tip too, like, um... For those of you young transgenders still thinking, worried about makeup and stuff, like pick a pick some part of your face and like paint that up. Don't do it all because that's the difference between like having too much makeup and like I don't know horror or clown. You know, <laughs> like if you like paint your eyes really like crazy and then lots of lipstick and lots of blush, it's going to like look bad and clash. So just pick a spot and focus on that, I guess. <clears throat> but um. God, where was I going with all this? So, yeah. Lots of fun stuff. Lots of free time. Lots of soccer coming up. Um, I have a game today. Game Saturday. And then, like, three weeks off. Oh, yeah. The Dr. Mary thing. <laughs> so, and then I'm also getting my cheekbones done. Which I'm really excited about. I'm so self-conscious. Like, every time. Like, I when I have my hair back like this. Or when I'm laying down. And you get this. Uh, like, you just really see that. I don't know, like, it bugs me, so, and then, like, this bone right here, he's gonna work on, so, I'm really excited, um, so I'll do a video for that, too, so you see the before and afters, but, um, yeah, there's lots of stuff going on, but yeah, look for that video to come, like, later today or tomorrow, I'm really excited about it, and, like, anyone out there who's trans and who's just at all interested in sports, high school level, college level, um, there's even, like, 
they're talking about the IOC, the International Olympic Committee, has uh, been working on this since like 2004. But they're like their policy is is like really biased and like based in like assumptions and um, I I don't want to read it all. <laughs> I will like read it when I have highlighted it and like got that real story for you and the good points. So, and then I'll have like um, like hyperlinks and stuff so you can actually like download the file yourself and uh, educate yourself and coaches or whatever. So, very cool. But I'll talk to you all later. Um, keep going to the fan page. Like I can't believe it. it's it's definitely taking on a life of its own and. Um, I mean, without me, and it's really cool. I've seen some uh, very flattering um, things said about me on there. Uh, yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad that 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 page is helping everyone. It's really just like a, a living, breathing forum now for people to like self-educate and talk to each other and go through this process with like peers. Like when I was doing it, it was very, um, it's very individual. You know, it's it's like. This is the type of thing that when you search for it on your computer, you like clear your, your history, and um, you know because you don't want people to find out, and so it's really tough. You can't really go to people and ask like how they did it, and now you can. So definitely check that out. Keep going, um, changing lives and stuff. So um, that's it. I'll talk to you later.